Chad LeBron with the Lab Mixed Martial Arts. We're going to go for our technique of the week again here. Today what we're going to talk about is pummeling. Last week we did a technique for striking, so we're going to mix it into the clinch here. you got to be good at three ranges to be a complete mixed martial artist. you got to be good at your striking, the clinch, and you got to be good at the grappling. Okay, so here we're in a 50-50 tumble here, meaning I have one underhook, he has one underhook. Whoever controls the underhook controls the game here. So if I swim this hand under and get both double underhooks, I'm going to be much easier for me to take him to the ground. Okay, so what we're going to do from here is I'm in my right hand on the hook, right foot forward. Now, as we start pummeling here, we're trying to get position. We're pummeling through. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to overhook this hand and I'm going to keep it tight to my body here. Now, from here, go ahead and circle around over here. I have a tight left overhook here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to step back with my right leg and turn my shoulder down. Okay, from here it's going to bring his head down. Now I'm going to take my right hand and I'm going to come over top and I'm going to grab his chin. Get that good chin control. Now my left hand grabs my right wrist and I'm going to come in here for my guillotine for the tap. Very easy. The key though is as I'm following here, coming through, coming through, I have a deep overhook. I'm going to step back and turn my shoulder down. You need to step back and put a lot of pressure here. Now from here, I reach my right hand over. I control his chin. Put the meaty part of my thumb right in his left carotid. My left hand grabs my right wrist. Now I'm going to come up and in, keeping this elbow pinched. All right, this is a very tight guillotine. One more time. So I'm here. I reach over deep. I step back, now I come over top, and I take for the guillotine. That's technique of the week.